And welcome back, SBT. Uh, for the first take of this, there was no second. Shut the hell up. Um, my name is Keith, and this is my round one SBT game against my opponent, Duke Loans, with his team, the Johto Jukes. You're looking at it right now. Tapu Koko, Cinderace, Swampert, Gudra, Skarmory, Mega Heracross, Zarude, Vanillux, Nihiligo, Hypno, and Arctazolt. Now, um, this is a pretty interesting team. This Mega Heracross used to be a Miltank, and I really freaking wish it was still a Miltank, because I feel like that makes this matchup all, oh, that would have made this matchup a lot easier for me. But, getting into the team, um, for those who don't remember, this is my team here. Um, I think it's an interesting matchup because it's a thing where it's something where I really struggled to pick the sixth Pokemon because I had a bunch of Pokemon that were just sort of like okay. Uh, but we'll get to that later. First, we'll pick the first Pokemon I picked, Nava Vihara, Darmanitan. Um, so before I get into the sort of details of this, I'm gonna say uh, big shout outs to Electric for helping me build this team, and uh, also Electric if you're listening. You're not going to like me pronouncing these names, I can tell. You probably, you know, so uh, enjoy that. This is what you get for giving me, for helping me with this suggestion of nicknames. I, I think it was like a riff thing we did, I don't remember. But yeah, um, yeah, I'm just going to butcher them all for the entire season and you get to enjoy that. Anyway, uh, fire, good move here. Look at the fire resists. Only Swampert really wants to take it. None of the fire resists have recovery. Um, yeah. This is just, uh, it's just a pretty good scuff option. It can get run adamant because the only thing, uh, you know, the, the only other uh, Pokemon is, uh, the only po like the Pokemon has to, I think, uh, oh, I don't know. sorry, okay. This is like 1.40 in the morning. Um, after I worked, so I'm quite tired. So if I'm low energy or I'm just stuttering, it's only because I'm like, it's because I'm a complete idiot, but also because, you know, man's got to sleep. Anyway, um, yeah, so Scarfed Arm, classic set, pretty good heal. Uh, can run adamant because Gudra is the fastest Pokemon that is slower than it on the opposite team. So it's got speed for Gudra. Um, for Scarf Goudreau. Uh, I wouldn't actually speed for Scarf Goudreau, but I would speed for Scarf in the Lux. And Scarf Goudreau is, um, you know, one stat point difference, so it's like you might as well. The thing with uh, Juke is I've never played him, so I don't actually know how to build for him. So, yeah, um, the 224 Adamant is for a specific calc, and I can't quite remember because Electric and I built these a few days ago. And then I put the rest into HP. I want a bunch of HP because if I'm clicking Flare Blitz a lot, which I feel like I am, that that could be the difference between getting an extra Flare Blitz in to clean up in the end game, and that's really important. So yeah, a Pokemon number two, Da Al Hajar, Diancy, Life Orb, Trick. Yeah, it's a Trick Room Sweeper. So um, I like. I think Diancy is pretty cool in Trick Room. And um, especially in this matchup, because, uh, you know, look at its moves. Moonblast, Power Gym, Mystical Fire. A lot of things here are taking a lot of damage from those moves, right? Like Coco and enjoying it. Cinderace is getting hit super effectively. Swampert's not enjoying it. Kingdra's getting hit super effectively. Skarm's getting hit super effectively. This is getting, like, this is, this, a lot of things are getting hit super effectively here. Neal Ego is really the only thing that's happy to switch in, but... That's still taking a fair amount of chip, and you know, Nihiligo has no recovery. Um, yeah. Uh, I, I, I think it's only Nihiligo, Tapu Koko, and Hypno that I don't hit super effectively, but look, any chip on Tapu Koko, really good anyway. And I don't think Hypno is a Pokemon, especially in this matchup. Watch it come and prove me wrong. But yeah, I feel like this is either going to clean up in the late game, or it's going to bust a hole in something in the mid game. And that's pretty cool. Okay. Uh, and also, I think it's a set that 
my opponent really won't expect, and for, probably for good reason, but um, I, I think it's gonna be cool. Okay, then we've got a Petra of my Gliscor set. Uh, so these are usually a lot more complicated than I normally do things because I'm trying to get really good at prepping and building. So I'm really trying for this. Like you'll see it in the WPF, how much more simple most of my builds are, except for like one or two. Um, this Gliscor set took me an electric ages because Gliscor, it's a Pokemon that the more effort you put into it, the better it typically is, right? So uh, this Gliscor right here has, um, it's got the attack to, I think, kill Mega for max HP Mega Herogross with the dual wing beat. And also it isn't, you know, and it also threatens a lot of stuff. And basically at this point, was that a choice where I either made it more offensive or more like more physically offensive, more physically defensive? And I ended up going more physically offensive. And that might have been a mistake, but it might not have been. I don't know. It's one of the things we'll see. Like, it's actually a very tough decision. But, um, yeah, this is, I think this Pokemon can especially, like, really, really, really hurt a lot of stuff. Um, I made sure to put some speed into it, just so that, um, like, bulky Heracross with a tiny bit of speed never outspeeds us. Like, I, you know, bulky Gudra with a bit of H speed and it doesn't outspeed us. Um, yeah, because I feel like because I'm the more offensive variant, this speed's actually pretty important. So that some I invested, so that some, you know, Pokemon don't at speed us. Uh, yeah, the special defense is to take any Haligo uh, power gems, just without caring. Uh, this is, you know, my first Pokemon. No, my first Pokemon. But it's, um, it's my first time using Gliscor in a non-HP format. I've probably talked about this. So I'm looking forward to using this thing. Even though it's I don't have that much defensive investment into it, I think it's still going to just, you know, heal a bazillion T percent and annoy the shit out of our opponent. Um, yeah. Uh, what's my next? What is my point here? Um, yeah. Uh, the, I... What? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Why did I go attack? So I went attack because I thought it was just more safe and more useful against most things. Like, what else am I using the physical defense for? It's Cinderace and, like, physical Coco, which I don't think is a thing. And it's rude, which I'm not worried about anyway. Um, and Arctazol, which kills me anyway. So I've just felt like the offense against some of these Pokemon is a lot more appreciated. And, um, yeah. Uh, Earthquake to Wing Beat hits a lot of stuff, except for Skarmory. <gasps> I have, um, I have Taunt for Skarmory, so I probably beat it anyway. Um, yeah. This goes pretty cool like that. I don't have much else to say. Uh, then my next one is Kartana with the Skyplate. Uh, yeah. Aerial Ace. I want to hit... You know, I want to chip the hell out of Mega Heracross. Aerial Ace Skyplate does that. Uh, yeah, it's also got Knock Off. Knock Off, pretty cool. And it's also got Leaf Blade. Leaf Blade, pretty cool. It just, like, obliterates Swampert. And it's also my Defogger, because I think it's actually going to force out a lot of Pokemon and get a lot of free turns to Defog. And because I didn't bring another Pokemon that can learn Defog besides the score, and I need the full moves it has on it. Um, as is often the case with Gliscor. So, yeah. Um, I... Oh God, I forget what the 168 special... Uh, 168 attack is for, but it's a specific calc. And I wanted to put as much into special defense as possible. So, uh, just in case of... Um, revenge is from, like, Scarf Nihiligo. And it can, like, probably live them a lot easier, a little bit easier now. And that's pretty good. Um. Yeah. Oh, God, I'm so tired. I think I, I was planning on doing the WPF one after this, but I might not. We'll see how we go. Um, okay, the next one in up. This is a heat as hell set. The Hanging Gardens. Mega Venusaur. So, um, I need to worry about the ice, the hail, right? I actually do. It's pretty depressing that I need to worry about it. But, uh, I just feel like that's something I should care about. So, 
I have Pegaphenosaurus sitting here looking pretty damn fine if I say so myself. Um, this has the defense to come in on that stupid Pokemon, Arctazult, and live its bolt beaks and its ice moves, bring up the sunny day, and heal itself a lot of HP with the boost from Synthesis. Um, apart from the Heligo, the combination of um, Sludge Bomb and Fire Weather Ball also does like also does pretty well at hitting most things. Um, because it's like Spideff, like the Spideff tank and Gudra and Swampert, both of them don't like getting poisoned. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, uh, the only thing, the only problem is, once again, the Heligo, but I feel like any chip on the Heligo is fine in this matchup. The Heligo, I think it's the big issue. The Heligo and Cinderace, I think, are the big issues for this drop, especially Cinderace and Sun. Right, I'm setting up Sun for Cinderace, and that is scary. Thankfully, it's just Blaze, not Lamero, but still, like, those, I think, are the two issues with this, like, the two sort of biggest weaknesses of this team, so they'll have to be played around pretty carefully. But, um... I was saying this for a while, but, um, not for a while, but I was saying this, like, in pre uh, at the start. The last Pokemon was a choice between four. It was a choice between Noivern, Rodon Wash, Azelf, and I believe Blissey. I thought all four of them had something to offer in this matchup, but nothing, like, ridiculously amazing. It was just that two could defog and two could, um, rock, right? And it was pretty cool. Um, eventually... <sighs> Yawn. I settled on Azelf because I wanted a rocker and I wanted something fast and I wanted a pivot and this does all of that. That's a second sort of thing for knockoff and that's pretty cool. Um, Stealth Rock is good and I. Psychic's good. Like, you know, it's just it's a pretty basic set to be honest. Um, it's got special attack so that it two hit KOs, I believe, Cinderace? 2k is something and um yeah it's my rock up that's pretty good because rocks are pretty good in this matchup unless he's running boots on a lot of stuff but then it can just knock them off yeah yeah, yeah. and um you can't have boots on mega Howard cross so that makes it that, that that's pretty cool and boots arc dissolve is really weak but regardless, um, yeah, this is the team, and we'll have to see how good we do. Hopefully we get a win. See you guys when it's time for a game after I've had a nap or two. Bye. Hello, I'm back with a brand new track, and I was an idiot that just realized, uh, when I tried to challenge Chip, that Glasgow is not released, so it doesn't get to a wing beat. So, yeah, I'm in... It's too late to change the team, but uh, that's a thing. So, uh, I'm concerned. <laughs> Just a little bit. Uh, it's fine though. It's fine. I'll win, right? I'll, I'll just, I'll just, I'll win somehow. Find a way to win. Yeah, so um, I'm gonna have to try really hard to make the actual video better because I don't think my commentary for that last one was pretty good. So uh, how is everyone today? Um, it's gonna suck if I get a 6-0 and then lose this one, but oh well. Um, it's, yeah, I'm actually really worried about this because not just the dual wing beat thing, I was worried about it before, but this is a team style that I haven't really used. So the WPF one, which I might be uploading first or second, it depends. Probably second because I've spoiled what happened, what's happened. That's my sort of team. That is exactly what my what my sort of team is. This not so much. Okay, I mean, yeah, this one, this really bulky team, not so much. So, uh, good luck. Um, so, 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 so. so. It's not libero. Um, can choice ban U turn kill? No, choice ban Pokemon. <laughs> Fuck. Um, 
Okay, so, looking at this team, uh, over Ross. I'm very glad Nihiligo isn't here. Like, really fucking glad. Uh, there's also no Coco, which is interesting. Uh, I guess it doesn't really do much to, uh, some of my Pokemon. Yeah, fair. Um, he, he's really prepped hard for the school, which is fine. Uh, Okay, so what am I leading with? I could lead with Azelf. I could lead with I think I like leading with Azelf, because at the end of the day, Rox is good here. And I think he... He can lead with Vanillox, and that's fine if he leads with Vanillox. He can lead with... Uh, I think it's fine if he leads with anything, except for specifically Banded Cinderace. Banded <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Watch this be Banded. Watch this be banded. Watch this be fucking banded. Um, yeah. Okay, this is banded, by the way. It's banded. Whatever. Don't care. You turn, please. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, this is... This is 100%. I really think this is a banded, uh, fucking Cinderace. Um... What can I say? I am a healthy John. Just, just call me Keith Shell John. Oh, whatever, we'll just fucking play the stuff rock. Yep, it's banded! <laughs> wait, no, it's not. Oh, wait, it might be. Yeah, it is banded. But it, that's not a death, so we're good. Um. Yeah. Yeah, no, that, that has to be banded, because, uh, yeah, that's banded. Uh, okay, so we know that's banded. That's interesting. Um, I think we just want a free knockoff, don't we? Do we? Do we care about this? What does this beat? Like, fuck all. Uh, I guess Heracross, but it doesn't even beat it. It just sort of chips it, and I've got stuff for it anyway. So it could be a knockoff. Yeah. Um, it, because that's banded, um, there are a few things. Uh, it being banned is interesting. <sighs> you know, do I care about this thing? Uh, so it doesn't beat that. I guess it ships that. <sighs> what are we U-turning into, though? <laughs> Fucking, we don't have a good switch into this no matter what it does, so we're knocking this off to get rid of its bullshit. Yeah, we got it. It's fine. Um, do I? Okay, so knowing that, knowing what it is, knowing what Gudra is, I just wanted to get rid of its stupid AV. Uh, that's got a lot of defense. Yeah, that's got a lot of defense. It's probably not modest. It's probably max defense. That's interesting. With no assault vest. What does Dion what does Dionki do to it? <sighs> Not max damage, so we probably wanna just go dumb. Cause he's got no way of healing now. But he is there attack? I got one of them straight here. So I think we go Do I just go Venusaur and then click fucking Sunny Day? That's funny. <laughs> it is quite funny. Um, I should have been chlorophyll and maybe. Oh well. Um, wait, how much does this do? Because it, it's got a lot of defense, though. It does have a lot of defense. But why don't I just fucking. I've got no idea, man, about this fucking team. I've got none. I got no idea. Like, I'm gonna be honest. Mega Evolution, and then I predict. I am pre personally predicting a Skarmory, because I don't think this gets Psychic or Flying Move, so I'm personally predicting a Skarmory to come in right now. <sighs> Fuck. 
fuck, this is so risky. Because here's the problem. Here's the problem. Cinderace, right? With a... Uh, it's healthy. But with a, uh... Choice band. In the sun. <laughs> beats the shit out of me. Ugh. Fuck. But I got to. I've got to. <laughs> because... Yeah, because I think he's going into scum. There we go. Oh, tasty, 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 tasty. Whew. Whew. In the sun. Get in there. Get in there. Let's go. Oh, whatever. Um, we'll just set up the sun again, right? Uh, he might go into Cinderace. Do I care if he goes into Cinderace? No. Wait. No, I don't. <laughs> uh, uh, I probably should have predicted that. It's not heavy duty boots, is it? No, it is heavy duty boots. Wait, no point stone still again, so it could be choice specs. Uh, does choice specs matter? Uh, it kind of does. Um, if he specs, this is really bad because he just sort of wins, right? Kind of. Uh, well, Sunny Day, the very least, helps a little. So, I think we. Sunny Day. Whatever, man. Um. He's not. Br he's not bringing. He's, he's. He's switching. He has to. Right? Because, like. In the sun, Vanillux, with a ball, it's, it, that's a dead Vanillux, right? Uh, with a reaction with a rover, yeah, it's not a dead Ah, uh, ah, uh, whatever. Um, I can just sludge bomb because it's not dead regardless. But he switches sl sludge bombing and getting the poison on this Gudra. Come on, Sh Jesus. Because that's not a salt vest. Yeah, that's we've decided that that's not a salt vest. Sludge bomb. With the Aurora Veil up. Okay, that's that's fair. Jesus Christ, what is this? Okay, what is this? Because it's defensive. So what does he even have for this in the sun? Actually, I don't care. Right? What, what does it do? Because it's not offensive, so it can't exactly... I just keep clicking Sludge Bomb. Alrighty. Um, yeah, <laughs> um, I think he might go into Skarmory now, so I think I clicked Weatherball, oh no, he didn't go into Skarmory, whatever, I can get up on Sunny then, sorry, no. whoa, 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 <laughs> what the fuck, <laughs> dip, 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 um, yeah, so it's banded, and that's scary. It's banded, and that's scary. That's all I have to say, really. Um, oh, Sludge Bomb's doing fuck all, isn't it? Yeah. Well, then, what do I care? I'm cleaning with uh, this thing. That's literally the only thing that can actually hurt Mega Venusaur. Right? So don't I just go into Gliscor and I get it, it's in the sun. It's in the sun. It's in the sun. And that matters. Choice band in the sun. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> this is just so risky. He's beating the crap out of me. Um. Mega Vansor. We also know that it's out of. Right, it's, it's got to be adamant, right? Because otherwise it wouldn't have, there's got to be jolly, otherwise it wouldn't have had to off, right? Yeah, okay, so we know it's jolly. Um, Jesus. Do I just click fucking synthesis? That's so bad. I can't do it.
Alrighty, good. Um, now that we've done that, we can... Oh, fuck. It kills everything! <laughs> um, wait, does it kill the Yonki? No, it doesn't. Wait, and the sun, and then it's not the sun. Okay, it doesn't. And that's cool. But Dionki, I kind of need for the trick room stuff. So what does this do right now? Uh, this is important for nothing. It dies to everything. Okay. Wait, no, it probably sets up on Skull. Yeah, probably sets up on Skull. Probably gets back to health. It gets itself back on Skull. So what the fuck do I do then? I don't know. Right. So let's look at the positives. Positives. This thing comes in and wins. That's a good positive. Well, yeah, don't I just let this die and then bring in this thing and then fucking... Oh, don't I? Do I let him go to school? Do I let him go to school? Because, uh, here's the thing. I'm just assume he's gonna miss one eventually. Glisco. Do I need Glisco? Uh, 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 yeah, whatever. Let's just go. Let's just go. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go. Please switch. Please fucking switch. Please switch. Please switch, Mr. Duke. Please, please, please switch, Mr. Duke. Hey, Mr. Duke, you should switch. Come on, Mr. Duke, please switch. Come on. I'm a- I am up a creek without a fucking paddle. Uh, okay, that's bad. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> um... I forgot. Wait, no. What? Why do I do so little damage to it? Ah, uh, what am I doing? Whatever, he's looking. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I fucking doing here? I guess I'm blasting, getting. That's weird. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's okay. Um. damage or about what is being run at all I am <sighs> fuck me I don't know what to do I have to fucking so this gets in and wins right yes so it's like getting in on that that okay it's getting in on a few things so don't I just get the score because uh, he's probably gonna want to sack something to protect that yeah okay okay because that's well it's gonna want something why is he on? I don't know, man. I don't know. Um, but yeah, okay. We have to. We have to trust ourselves because this needs to live. So, <laughs> fuck me. Fuck me. I don't. I don't know! <laughs> How did it do so much? This has to be offensive, right? Yeah, this is offensive as fuck. <laughs> so we have to go into Petro, expecting him to switch, or else we're getting 6 0 I'm in a. Man. Man. Mans. Help me, mans. Yeah, please switch. Sir? Okay, it's fine. It's actually fine. everything and let if it can fucking hit him so um do I just go into 
Oh man, it's so risky. It's so risky. But I think I gotta trust myself and the instincts here. Because then I get essentially a free kill. Because without a uh, assault first. Yeah, because it's gonna fuck all special attack anyway. It's gonna fuck all attack, so without an assault first. It's DLC. Jesus. <laughs> Why is this so fat? Why is it so fat? I don't know. I, don't, I wish I knew. I, I do wish I knew why it was so fat, but I don't. Oh, oof. 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 That was fucking lucky. I'm taking it. <laughs> I'm taking it to the bank. I'm taking that. Fucking hell. Boy, am I taking that. Alrighty. Let's go into fucking Dom and then click fire move and literally win. Okay. Yeah, 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 actually, yeah, I think we win now. Fled, let's, let's go. Wait, oh shit. Yeah, that's sturdy. That's fucking sturdy. That is sturdy. Shit, 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 What is he doing, man? I don't even know. Whatever. The thing that literally does nothing to me. Wait, no. We're doing, uh... Yeah, no, if it, if it literally does nothing to me, we need a... Click earthquake so that nothing gets in. Like, literally. Heracross. Uh, without that much damage... Should be able to aerial ace it and win. So we're in a, we, we are and we still are in a bit of a position, but <sighs> that helps, <laughs> right? Not having to worry about that stupid fucking piece of garbage helps. Um, so with this, it's click and flip turn. Wait, how much did the flip turn do to turn two to Gliscor? So we got Gliscor, and we got Swamp Hurt, defensive. Lip turn. So it's not got attack investment. It's not got physical attack investment. Here's the thing, he kills this with a skull. Um, yeah, no, I, I, I sweep with a... Uh, because with a... Uh, because I'm probably faster. So I'd probably get some chip. And uh, at that point, Dom does a fucking quick flip or something. Wait, no. Oh, that's why it's doing. I'm gonna fucking Aurora Mail up. I'm the moron. I am the biggest moron. Oh, it's faster. Okay. That's fair. Oh. Ah, Jesus Christ. So we just need more chip on this stupid thing. And we got it. Um, this is gonna kill this, and that's fine, because now we win. Yes. Yeah, cool. Sweet. Sweet. Amazing. Excellent. Ex Viva Excellente. Cool. I think this is GG, yeah. I think this is GG. Skarm's fucking dying. Yeah, Skarm's dying after rocks. And it's leftovers. Uh, yeah, it's over. I think this is over. I hope this is... <laughs> it's not over. We're in fucking trouble. Uh, so... But we gotta... We just gotta pray. Hope and pray. Hope and pray. Hope and pray. I mean, like, I still, it, it's fine. It, 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 
I, I still had a way out. I just needed to chip on. I mean, and I think you know, it's like the hydro pump miss sucked. I probably could still win from there, but yeah, that sucked. I think I just need to have the HP, which I probably do. He really should have gone Vinolux, and I don't know why he's not hasn't gone Vinolux. Um, yeah, he should have gone Vinolux. Whatever, I win. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah, it helped a lot. I, it made it a little easier to clean up. Made it a little easier to clean up. Um, yeah. Uh, you know. Um, the hype, like, here's the thing, I'm not gonna say it didn't matter, because fucking no one likes just hearing that didn't matter when hacks happens to them, right? At the end of the day, that's just scummy to go like, well, it's not scummy, but it just, it's always annoying when you get hacks a little bit, and it's like, it didn't matter. And it's like, you know, a lot of the time people are just salty and you can let them be salty, and then after like a little bit, they'll be fine, don't provoke them. Um, um, it was illegal. It didn't let me validate it. I had it. I fucking I recorded a pre-game thingo last night with dual wing beat on it. <laughs> um I recorded a pre-game thing, like, yeah, but, <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Cheap man. Good luck with the rest of your season. But yeah, um, it's like, it sucked because I EV'd the crap out of her. Um, yeah, so that was it. Uh, hopefully that commentary is a little better. It was still me just stressing over things. Um, I don't know how much of Hydro Pump ha ha I have to rewatch it. I don't, like, at the end of the day, I was... I probably should have vocalised what I was trying to do, but at the end of the day, it's like one of these two will sweep up, right? At the end of the day. Um, and I should have vocalised that a little sooner. But, uh, yeah, the second, uh, I just needed to this to come in on something that wasn't skarmory so that it didn't get sturdy, and then I just cleaned up with it because it was very, very strong. Once I scouted that he didn't have his fast scuffle. Um, but yeah, that was uh, week one. Got managed to get through that. It was not nearly as easy as my WPF one. But win's a win. A win is a win is a win is a win. Anyway, I'll uh, see you guys next time.